Sorry, I didn't see you there. There, that's better. I did my hair. How do you like it? It's kind of big. But it's fun. And purple, my favorite color. Hi guys, it's Melody Lane and we are doing some videos on the photo booth cartridge. Yeah, I said we. Crafts by Two, Nanny Rose, and Tabitha from Shutterscape Creations. We're all doing videos on these today. I'll put the links to all of the videos in the description below. And make sure you watch this video all the way to the end. Why do you ask? There's a bonus clip for you for using these and making a card. The little trick in there. So keep watching. Okay, so I have everything here. I'm going to put it together. So I think I'm just going to use this most for most of everything. And I'm probably going to do this in fast motion for this part. So pay attention. Okay, these were so easy to put together. That went real quick. The hair is a little bit harder to get it on straight. I didn't get it on straight. Maybe if you used wet glue, you could move it around a little easier. But I think that's okay the way it is. And this one worked out pretty good. Again, if you use wet glue on these, you can probably move it around a little bit and then let it dry. Mustache was pretty easy. So, and, and I have my, I cut these out with my iPad app, and I love this. I can just have it sit here, and if I need to look at the images, I can see how they go. So, I just love this. This iPad app will be out in January 2015. So, now let's put the skewers on. You could put these on in so many ways. I think I'm just gonna use some of my close to my heart foam tape. Let's see how this works. Um, hot glue will also work. Let's put it on right. there. Cool. Foam tape works great. And my glasses go. Here they are. And some of the pictures, I'm going to put some rhinestones on this. Some of the pictures I've seen, they actually put the rhinestone or the glasses through. They cut holes in here and then put the glasses through it and then wore these like real glasses. I'm going to add some rhinestones. These are from Michael's Recollections. This little thing was in here. You get all those and I get them when you get a really good deal or they have a coupon. 
They come in all colors. So I'm just going to finish putting these together, putting these on. I'm going to put all the skewers, skewers on, like I showed you with the phone tape. Just stick that on, and I'll be done. It's so easy. Okay, I do want to show you this a little bit, too. This is a quick stick, and it, I can maybe give you a link in the description below. And it's, it picks up the little bitty rhinestones. It's so much easier and quicker to use this. I actually won this in a contest and never seen them before and so thankful for this. So much faster. I could cover this whole thing with these now. And then I think I'm going to use some of this Recollections glitter glue and add a little more. Okay, I'm going to continue this and I'll come back. Okay, on the mustache. <laughs> I'm going to add a little wink of Stella, if you can see it. Wink of Stella. I don't know what color this is. Looks like it's glittery. I'm just going to put some on the black strips. This looks like it's a silver glitter. it looks like it's gray, purplish, with a little black mixed in. And actually, I think the mustache, I'm just going to try to stick in on my face. Okay, got them all done. It was really quick. I didn't have to get my glue gun out or anything. I just used my close to my heart foam tape. Worked wonders. And stay tuned and watch me make this card out of the leftover pieces. Alright guys, thanks for watching. It wasn't it easy? It's so easy to put all this together and I want to thank a few of my subs... I want to thank a few of my Patreons for supporting me. Alright, keep watching. After the credits, there's more video. You don't want to miss it. Here's a shout out to Patricia Gamble, Lady Fair, Cheryl Fur, Peggy Hera, Gracie, Denise Tuttle, Carla Boardman, Debbie Dickerson, John, Misty Lewis, Ray Nisa, Kathleen Kelly Tilly, Jean Williams Pettit, Sherilyn Brown, Lasagna Jackson, Heather Summer, Sharon Mescula. Thank you guys. Okay, I just wanted to show you a little trick. I was taking this off and one thing you have to know if you're new to this, you have to like turn your, it's like all in the twisting. When you're taking this off, you can't just rip it off because some of these pieces are deep in here. You have to be really careful. The hardest part was this R going all the way up inside here. You have to like 
really work at it, then work in other spots, then go around, then you have to like go through the middle where this is and lift it up from each way, okay? So you have to do it slowly and carefully. And then you're left with this. Well, I don't like to waste anything. So, I'm going to use this, but they're all separate letters, and I hate trying to get things straight and even. It just does not work for me. Actually, if I would have cut this out in vinyl, it would have been so much easier. I could have just lifted this off and then put transfer paper over this and used it. But I just thought of that just now as I'm doing this video. That would have been a great idea. But vinyl does cost more than paper. So I thought, well, I could make a card. I fold this in half. This is a half a sheet and I didn't cut it very well. I just like ran and cut this really fast. Half a sheet of eight and a half by 11. And I thought, I think this will fit on there. Yep, barely fits. Okay, so I thought, well, we'll put some washi tape on it. You can use any washi tape, but this is wider washi tape. They even have really wide washi tape. But I'm just using this because it's wider. And I'm just gonna go across here. Actually, I don't think I did that enough. <laughs> Let's go past it so I have something to grab onto. Burnish it down like you do with vinyl. Okay, now I'm going to pick this up. Let's pick this off the mat. Now what I'm going to do, I have them all straight and even. How awesome is that? Okay, let's put them on this card. First we have to put adhesive on the back of them. So I'm just using my Zig to a glue. This is an awesome glue. I usually get it when I have coupon, Hobby Lobby, Michaels, Joann's. It's not on sale a lot, so when you can't find something on sale, or not on sale when you have your coupon, because coupons don't usually work on sale items, stock up on the Zig Two Way Glue. You can also use it to re-stick your Cricut mats. It has a wide one. And it has a smaller one too. So it has different sizes of this glue. And it's temporary if you were to let it dry and then stick it on. So after I put this on, I go back and just to make sure it's not dry, I just put some dots around on where I've already done it to make sure it sticks. Okay. Now, I'm just going to kind of eyeball it for this right now. Okay, now. Okay, some of the paper, like this paper is like in layers, some of it's coming up with the washi tape. 
But that's okay, because who wants white plain paper when you can have glitter? Okay, so now let's do the next one. And then we're going to cover this in stickles. There we go. Add a little green to it. There we go. A nice simple card, really quick and easy. Thanks for watching everyone. Love you and see you in the next video.